G'day there, I'm Alan and welcome to Alan Vale Farm. When we first thought about looking for our property, uh, the first thing we did was do a quick walk around the site and uh, we parked at the front gate, which is fairly cool, shady, covered with trees from, from next door. And as we started to walk, we realised that the fence was in really poor condition. Uh, but we did find the power was on the site. There was a green dome there. And as we walked down a uh, creek at the bottom corner, and uh, fences weren't too good. I uh, did find out later on that the fences were put in in 1968, and though they've been rewired, it wasn't much of a flash job. There is a dam on site. looks fairly new. doesn't have much water in it. And... There are a few rams in the paddock, so the fence is not flash, it's enough to hold the sheep in and only just. I think at a pinch they could probably hop over the fence and eat the grass next door if it was any greener. As we walked further around, we found one area was badly scoured and um, digging a quick little hole with my hands so I could taste the ground, the water was quite saline and um, that would obviously have to be dealt with. Um, there were some green patches in the paddock but they were a funny smelling weed and I took a sample, it turned out they were mint weed and that wasn't much chop either. Uh, and at the top of the paddock coming back along the southern side, very rocky quartz. Um, it was actually on the dark, uh, dark and fault line and it's a gold bearing ore but um, not in my patch. And continuing along, the only good fence was 100 or 150 metres between the, um, the, the last piece along Roadstale Road. The dam did have water in it, did look good. And one thing I did discover though, there was a funny bend in the bottom of the fence that wasn't on the plans, uh, because apparently the creek runs across the bottom corner. So there was a water source, um, possibly a bit saline in summer. And so we decided to buy the property. And very shortly after, um, I moved in, in a two-man tent, and we had a crop in the ground. <laughs> 